Jason Bateman <laughs> is Team Wolf 2. What's up, guys? Alex Ignatovich here with another episode of SLC Nerds 31 Screams. Today, we're going to talk about a movie from 1987 starring Little House on the Prairie star Jason Bateman. It's called Teen Wolf 2, as in Teen Wolf also, like T-O-O, -O, because he's also a werewolf. But it's kind of also 2, like T-W-O, it's, it's not spelled that way, but it's kind of like that because it's like a sequel. It's not like a true sequel because the main star is it's uh, his cousin. Michael J. Fox isn't in it, and Jason Bateman's not playing Scott Howard. He's Todd Howard. Todd, his cousin, who for some reason gets an athletic scholarship to uh, box in college, but he's not a boxer, he's a band geek. And that's made very apparent. Yeah, but what about that sports scholarship they gave you? I mean, the closest you ever came to an athletic field was playing clarinet in the marching band. Uh, but he does his best, he wolfs out, and uh, wouldn't you know it, he's pretty good at boxing when he's a monster. Uh, the movie's, you know, I mean, it's... Uh, I've seen worse sequels, okay? Uh, Teen Wolf is already pretty campy and cheesy as it is. Teen Wolf also, you know, it kind of plays that up a little bit. I feel like it was just they wanted to make a sequel to, you know, kind of have the success from the first one, and that's great. But it wasn't seriously needed. Um, there's some fun stuff going on. Jason Bateman, you know, great performance from him. Uh, you have some re recurring characters from the first movie, like Uncle Harold, Chubbs, uh, and then you even have the coach and Styles make a return, although they're played by different actors who, I mean, don't give the same performance, so it's... Eh. One of the weird things about this movie is that he fights... Uh, there's like a bully that's like his, his last opponent in the boxing match, right? Who is like boxing for another team, but I think he goes to his school because he like... He's at the school a lot? I don't know. That's kind of weird. Uh, but he got a boxing scholarship without being a boxer, so, you know. I mean, who knows if this school even has an accredited boxing program, am I right? But uh, definitely check out Teen Wolf 2. If you like the first one, you'll probably like the second one. It's decent. It has a really weird musical number where Jason Bateman is doing karaoke, and then later his voice is just still singing the whole song, and he's no longer singing. He's just dancing with the crowd, and they all have this big choreographed dance. You've seen dance scenes. I give this movie, I don't know, like, let's say three out of five. It's okay. It's pretty good. Uh, once again, I'm Alex Ignatovich. Thank you for watching. If you want to catch up on what I'm up to, follow me on YouTube at Alex Sucks. TV. Watch the old videos, get caught up, get psyched. I'm going to make new stuff. And again, thank you for watching SLC Nerds 31 Screams.